A moving tribute in Granite Bay. We all understand that people die, and it's just, it's part of war, and we just have to remember them. A special place honoring servicemen and women on the corner of Douglas Boulevard and Barton Road. Volunteers with the Rotary Club designed the Walk of Honor front and center to display flags of all five branches of the military, along with an American flag atop a 50-foot pole. We understand your pain, and we want to give you some place where you can come and you can reflect, you can have some memories, and you can know that other people understand that you have had this loss. As the flag flies high, hope is restored for the Gold Star moms who have lost so much. We need to remember who these people are. Patty Schumacher is here for her son, Victor Dew. The Granite Bay High School graduate had only been in Afghanistan for 18 days when an explosion took his life in 2010. They say that a man dies twice, once when he's given his final breath, and the second time he dies is when he is no longer remembered. And we don't want any of these people, any of our heroes forgotten. On Gold Star Mother's Day, she knows Victor's sacrifice won't be erased with time. He'll never be forgotten. He will never die a second time. He was just a great human being. And to be able to have generations down the road say, who is this person? Why is there his name on this bench? And to have them look it up and find out Victor's story and his battalion story and just do that research it's gonna he, he'll live karen meredith is also a gold star mom who pushed for the walk of honor she lost her only child first lieutenant ken ballard on memorial day 2004 in iraq losing a child burying a child is just there is no word for a parent who has lost a child Meredith says with less than 1% of the country serving these days, people aren't touched by wars as much. For her, this tribute in Granite Bay means the world. With that, I know that my son will not be forgotten. Gold Star moms are grateful for a place to reflect at Granite Bay Community Park, knowing now their community will get to learn about their local heroes.